They're just like a. Um, so hi, loved ones. Greetings. Thank you for being there. Hello, loved ones. I am Faith Mystic. It's nice to see you. Um, some of you are new names I'm not familiar with. I could attempt to say your names, but I need to get comfortable because I'm like literally healing right now i should be laying down in bed but i'm up here doing this and i wasn't allowed to for many days so i've had more energy today than i have in a while as you can see i've gotten a lot more pale um i've eaten a lot less food uh, the food in america is not the same it's really hard to like eat the food um there's just certain specific ones that I do trust. And it's just really hard, you know, like to find like real food some moments if you don't have your own gardens, I do. Um, but unfortunately the mayor of Antioch did not continue this year to abide by its agreement to me to stop the chemtrails and the planes from flying crap over the garden so I am allowing the rains to flood and wash and purify what is present what I can gather 
once they're washed off and clean, cleaner, I feel more comfortable with harvesting the seeds and making more and putting them in a safe place, you know. Um, it's a lot to go through, each of us in our own places that we exist at. We each have experiences that we're working through and it's, you know, we can't compare to each other's experiences in that way. But we do have to figure out survival practices to sustain healthy, healthily. So, you know, they teach us to drink a lot of water regularly. And when the water is not, when it's not clean, when the food's not clean, when the things are not clean, you want to get from other countries that are more clean. But even the sacred places that are very small, they don't even have a government. They even told me that they see planes and moments flying over their location, so. I've had visions like of many everywhere having like tubes of gardens, tubes, little tubes, like tons of locations, like small long ones. They look like those little tubes, like when you were little, you climbed through like those long tubes, like even at the like Chuck E. Cheese play structures and places, going through them, they're like tubes and they grow food nourishments and it's like massive gardens growing about and they grow outside of the biome habitats that were created to like harvest them. So I see that it will come into fruition. Like I, I already acknowledge what is to come and I am, um, I'm thankful for the integration of, of our loving family, that wherever I am globally, that some of you will remember me and that we will be able to meet again in that way if I am needed to come. Um, sorry about my Mikiash. Uh, we call it Mikiash in, Yim, in uh, like uh, Arabi. We call it Mikiash. And Mikiash is like from mountain ash. It's like from the mountain. It's makeup that's made from the mountain. And that's what I put on, but I honestly just like, I've been putting my salve on my head, on my face, and like not even like worrying about all of that as much. It's amazing that I did my hair today. You know, I like, I was looking at my hair, I was like, oh my gosh, like I haven't brushed it. It's starting to lock again. And I cut off a bunch of hair because I had a migraine the other day. So I cut my bangs like that much. Like, psh, I don't feel like hurting, you know, I might as well cut the hair off some. I have plenty, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> I do that regularly though. Like, you know, I have to, especially when it gets tangled that easily. It's tangles. I think that the movie Tangled was probably pretty close to home because I, I don't often eat because I try to avoid going downstairs because whenever I do, someone comes into the kitchen. I'm not gonna say who, because I have family members who stalk my, my TikTok page and other pages to make sure I don't talk about that being. But it's like the dragon slayer, like the kids, like they drew in like a map and they marked it downstairs. They said that that was, they didn't mark it, they said that was the dragon slayer. Like literally, like the dragon slayer, like beware. Like you have to like tiptoe around that, and just be like really quiet. So we try to be really quiet, but the, the hearing is super sharp, you know? Um, it's obvious we're really related and things, but <laughs> yeah, um, my life, has been interesting. Some moments I wonder why Disney was like trying to write stories about some of us, you know? And then changing the story lines and everything is just kind of weird. I'm really glad Pinocchio isn't real, but in a way, if you look up like the history of a certain island, then you'd find out that it's actually based on a true story. And it's a little bit different than what they've shown on the movie, but that island that they go to, just be careful. Like, honestly, kids, like, do not, do not talk to strangers who drive by you and try to have a conversation with you. 
If somebody stops their car and they look like they're gonna get out, you need to run. Run to a neighbor, run to a house that has like a car in the driveway and then you could ring their doorbell and they'll open the door and you tell them that somebody is trying to get you. You have to find a way. Trust me, I was like, I was adult napped. I was kidnapped. Like they tried to kidnap me um, multiple occasions when I was a kid, like so often. It was like wild. And then even as an adult, I've been like adult napped. I've been held hostage in the past. Like you have to be really careful who you trust. Be really, really careful because there's some like super not freaks well i guess they are kind of freaky um but they're not freaky like that they're like um predators the predators is what they are the predators and you've got to be careful because it's it's just a lot to go through and i'm really thankful that i was able to escape and be able to protect my children from predators too mostly i'm, I'm working on another one that needs help but you know like it's a lot to work through as a parent I'm gonna do another song now um I don't know the frequency of that's not really my favorite but I think I have to do it I think I'm gonna adjust the octave just take a moment to not get frustrated as I do this octave change see what it's an E Mm -hmm. That feels weird. I like it. It feels good weird. Ooh, I like the way that feels though. It's kind of nice. I feel it in like my heart space. Let's do some heart healing music. And boom, ba dee dee dum ba. One, two, three.
Judge me, I've got all solutions. Judge me, I've got not religion. Judge me, I've got all solutions. I am the right that I see inside my life, so I must be true within my spirit. Reason why. Judge not me, I've got no religion. Judge not me, I've got all solutions. Judge not me, I've got no religion. Judge not me.
up to rest soon. I'm like, I'm working through levels of pain that I don't usually have to deal with. And this is why I've been on bed rest, so that I don't hurt too. But it's all, it's all blessed. I'm going to come on YouTube next, I believe. Uh, I think actually I'm not. I'm just going to post the videos I did today on YouTube because I'm going to choose me. Yeah. I think I'm done doing actually. I need to rest. It hurts too much. Uh, it don't hurt too much. Yeah, it's actually like, oh. I love you. Thank you for your messages, my loves. Your loved ones. Aloha, all of you. I would love to take moments to greet you, but I honestly, I just need a rest. Okay, I love you.